What's up my beautiful bros? Pretty Man Inc. here with another mission in Worms Revolution. So now let's get going with Fugu Fountain. Okay, I just learned something. There's a particular worm I have to take care of immediately in the first two turns. Or he does some annoying shit. And I'm not, I'm not gonna have it on this channel. I'm not gonna have it. So hopefully I can land the same shot I did last time, which was right about here. Yeah, it was right about there. Except for he lands on the health this time, which was not what I intended. <laughs> oh, shit. I land actually went a lot different last time. He landed on the other side. And the other dude actually fell off into the water. Uh, you're not helping yourself much, bro. Okay, so I'll, I'll, I'll show you the worm that I was talking about when I said a worm that's gonna cause serious issues. Come on. I wish this worm was faster. Oh, Some damage to him. I just gave him a clean shot on me. He's still gonna do the same annoying thing, isn't he? We will bounce back. There, no, you don't got the balls. You are gonna do the same thing, aren't you? Oh, no, he's not. He's actually just gonna severely hurt me this time around. Okay, I guess I'll take that over what he normally does. Um, I'll use this chance to use this little fuck here to get an easy kill. Or what sometimes any- what should be an easy kill, even though half the time- would you- Oh, I guess that worm slid off. <laughs> fun, fun, fun. That's one less pain in the ass I have to deal with. Okay. Goodbye, worm. So that leaves nine pain in the butts to deal with now. Eight if this guy doesn't bury, him, bury himself out, which even if he does, he's going to start taking a lot of damage for it. Oh, that's going to... Ow! I didn't know he could hit me from there. I tried to move back when I shot, but it wouldn't let me. Oh, oh god, that was borderline. Mm, yeah. Okay. And that was the plan. It is the taking part that counts. <laughs> well started is half one. That worm is gonna get fucked in the butt. Or my king is gonna get airstriked in the face, and that's gonna hurt pretty badly. Oh, he's just gonna get hurt really bad. Why you know that? 
But you know what? I'm okay with that. Who's next? Kills King. Um, gonna move him deep into the recesses of the corner. And I guess next. This. Who do I want to take over, though? There. <laughs> Next turn, I can take out that one. That would leave seven worms. He's gonna. I feel like he's gonna be a dick and call in an airstrike. Oh no, he's gonna save his teammate. I'm hiding under one. Not a good idea if you're actually watching this at home. Okay, seven worms left, one drowning. I don't know what to do with that one yet. No, I, I, I could jump the other way. Okay, if I can just take care of him now, I should increase my chances at survival at least a little bit. You, wow, that one just killed itself. Okay, let's hope this works. Yeah, 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 stay alive. Okay, let's see if I can get a nice direct hit with this. Okay, nice direct hit. Mm. <laughs> eh. I don't like this. Uh, be gentle. Please. I can't believe that worm- that, The pen- like, must have been like five or six times I've played through this before. That worm has never once killed himself. It was inc it's incredible. Okay, I have no problem switching. Switch to 
I missed. I didn't hit, get the direct hit I needed. This is not good. Yeah, he goes next. A frog in a well does not know the great sea. <laughs> did I lodge him under there? Okay, I think I did. The harder we fall, the higher we bounce. And he got free. Oh god, if he loose shoots a rocket at that firework crack that firecracker I could be I could be hurting pretty bad. Silent water is dangerous water. Yep. That hurt. Seventy-seven damage. Plus one internet. There, that kills you, right? Where there is fish, there is water. Only a fool would perform. Okay, good. I mean, that most likely kills the big guy too. But he's got two worms in the water now. They might have a lot of health, but they're in the water. He has one worm here living on 12 health. He only has really two semi-healthy worms. And this one likes to waste my time. Okay. Let's turn switch with this guy one more time. Get him out of here. We use four worms with two drowning. I do have, admittedly, I have two worms that are super weak, but no one's touched my king yet. Thank God, this guy's probably gonna airstrike. Hopefully not. Actually, I don't think he will. There's not really anything he has a clear airstrike to. Oh, never mind. Tried anyway. Okay, big guy's turn. Plus one internet. Well, I guess I can see what's in here real quick. Is it Canada? Super shame. <laughs> Oh, okay, that was interesting. Now I know what the super cheap does. Jack Diddley. Oh, my question is, how do I get to the guy with 95? Hmm. Oh, another airstrike used. That one came closer. Well, I forgot there was a hole there. That could end up costing me the game. It's a three on four situation, two are dying. If that guy moves any further, he's gonna get hit with a gun. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Okay, thank God. Here. 
Uh, can I... Can I... Zoom out a little bit? What the hell? Oh, there it is. Jesus. Okay. Well, let's just grab the checkpoint right now while we can. Why? What? What? <laughs> what? Yeah, see? You just wasted like 10 seconds just staring at me. Oh my god, yes, yes, yes! Rocket there. Oh, yes, please. You're making it so much easier for when I actually attack next time. Wondering what I would save the next rocket for. There you go. Hello. Booyah! Just those two weak, weak little worms left. My king looks a handy dandy safe up in his little high horse castle. Thank God the stipulation wasn't to lose any worms because I did suicide. Oh, I can't believe that guy jumped down there and made it easier for me. I just wish they'd stop wasting their time. My time. Oh, is he actually gonna crawl out of the water? out with a grenade. Boom. Boom. Do we do it? Oh, now things are getting quite spooky. The golden child went all weird and doubled up. We thought he was having a vision about the location of the stone carrot, but it turned out to be wind. He does, however, think the stone carrot is calling to him. Yes, I know, he's talking to carrots. So if he starts wandering off somewhere, follow the little weirdo. That was an interesting level for sure. Tid did definitely catch some breaks there. Anyway, guys, don't forget to subscribe if you are new. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, whatever. If you are a fan of this series, or if you find this series later on down the road and you're watching it via whatever, feel free to make a fan playlist of all these videos. It's hard. I don't really have the time to necessarily go back and make a set playlist. And we only got five episodes left. I hope you guys enjoy. Like I said, see you in the next one. Peace.